Developing now, some frightening moments in Elizabeth, New Jersey, when a wall on the New Jersey Turnpike came crashing down Monday night. This after a truck overturned and hit the wall at the exit next to Newark Airport. CBS News' Elijah Westbrook has the latest from Elizabeth. Tuesday's morning rush on the NJ Turnpike went off without a hitch after emergency crews worked throughout the night clearing debris and removing two unstable sound barrier panels after state police say a tractor trailer nearly careened off the road. This was the chilling moment around 8 p.m. Monday when that wall was struck near the southbound outer lanes and large parts of concrete slabs came crashing down onto Elizabeth Avenue below. Watch as people standing across the street, including this woman seen holding a child, run to safety. I've been in town for over 30 years and I've never imagined I would see the turnpike missing a wall. It was very scary, but we saw that everyone got away safely, thank God. Turnpike officials say it took more than six hours to get this part of the southbound side of the highway back open. They also say the investigation into what caused the truck to overturn Monday night continues. The focus now is repairing and replacing the wall that shields this Elizabeth neighborhood from the noise of constant traffic on this also busy I-95. Highway engineers say they'll be assessing the area Tuesday, and their findings will determine when to give the green light to move forward. And at this time, we are not hearing of any injuries stemming from this incident. Efforts will continue in putting up a new wall. That's the latest here in Elizabeth, New Jersey. Elijah Westbrook, CBS 2 News. Thank you.